Well, howdy. This is a Grizzly 4003G, or it was. It's in the process of being converted. I've got it completely stripped down. I've got all the drive components off of it, the uh, carriage is off, all the drive rods. Uh, the new three phase motor is on, and the control cabinet is finished. That's the gray cabinet there behind. Of course, when the backsplash is on, it comes right up to the bottom of that cabinet, so it hides all those cables. And, of course, uh, Mach 3 is on the stand with the computer, so it can be moved around independently of the machine, so I can put it wherever I want, left side or right side. Works pretty good. Got the computer mounted down on the frame there. Anyway, I'll be making some short videos as I progress with this thing, get a little more done on it. I haven't been working on it for about seven or eight months. I've been busy. But uh, this is what it looks like. It's kind of ugly with all the parts off of it. But it uh, makes nice room for the motor. The uh, Z-axis motor goes right under that control panel. So that'll work out real nice. Let me show you the inside of the electronics cabinet. I worked on this most last winter. And uh, Got everything wired up. I've got my drive in there, my power supply for my DC voltage for the breakout board, and then my big toroid transformer for the uh, stepper drive controls. Or the these are hybrid servos I'm using here. Actually, they have feedback pots on them. Um, not that Mach 3 knows what to do with that because Mach 3 doesn't have any feedback ports on it. And I've got a few more parts to go in there. My spindle encoder's not in there yet, but the, there's the wire nuts hanging there for the 5-volt power supply. And then I've got a pigtail that all the limits will tie to is hanging there. So it'll finish up pretty nicely. It's a, got a nice vent fan motor in it, so it is ready to go. So uh, I'll be making some more videos and keeping everybody posted. A lot of work to do on this thing. Uh, I've got most of the parts made. I just need to fit everything up. I've got the ball screws all done. Both ends are done, machined. The uh, preloaded ball nuts are done. So everything is in process. A lot of it's laying on the bench. I've got stuff scattered everywhere. But uh, it's kind of a small shop, but that's what it takes to get everything done. So I'll be back in touch.